elementary school is under fire tonight for a new behavior system that some parents are now calling inappropriate. ABC Action News reporter Maricela Burgos live in Pasco County. All right, Maricela, what's this about? And look, the district admits they should have given these parents a heads up. They're saying D is good, A is bad, so democracy and conformity. But these are the two words that parents have an issue with, bullying and anarchy, and they say their kids should not be taught this right now. Any person, any age that looks at the system has to agree that it, it's somewhat asinine. Parents at Deer Park Elementary are angry over a new behavior system that's supposed to help their children. The goal for everyone is for students to behave and teachers to be able to teach. Parents are challenging it, calling it confusing, also fearing their kids will be labeled. It's telling my son that he has to conform to peer pressure, and that's what we strive at home not to teach our children. Author Dr. Marvin Marshall created the raise responsibility system. He says the point is to teach kids anarchy and bullying are unacceptable and what to strive for. The idea is to have great relationships with kids and to motivate them to want to behave responsibly. No student is going to be called an anarchist or a bully. Those are just terms that this program uses to describe what we don't want. The school has removed the flyers and the principal plans to meet with parents next week. The very fact that you have to have a meeting to explain to adults what the system means, how will a kindergartner understand that? Parents are not convinced this is the best system to use on elementary students. I don't agree that making changes to the system is going to make it work. Sometimes things are just too broken. So the meeting is on Tuesday. Three things could happen. They could keep this system, change it, or get rid of it. Reporting live, Maricela Burgos, ABC Action News.